Yeah, I'm thinking export buses straight onto a belt, underneath on the underside of a belt. So that the items just pop up onto the belt. They go into a brass funnel, like you were saying, or brass tunnel, I mean, which is set so that it'll only let a bunch out when there's one of everything available. And then it'll let one of each out. So Baiting on what I'm wondering where we're gonna put the actual funnel system. The funnel, because it's gotta be a big long, ten long mm -hmm. tunnel. And one space and funnels and yeah, right here all we really need it to go to. Uh can we bring it in closer by one? At least. Yeah, we could. And technically, could even come one more. Yep. Just trying to keep us as give, keep us as much race for our rocket launch pad as possible. Okay. Fair enough. I mean, obviously. Oh, no, we no, just... no. We need we need that one oh, we, out we... there for doing the uh, the corner with the gearbox. Oh, oh, I see. Yeah, okay. Gotcha. Oops. Oops. We just share the power between them easily. Maybe, if it's going the right direction. Oh, wait, but we were going to have the... We were going to have the feeder belts go slow and the long belt go fast. Weren't we? That was I kind of the idea. Uh, but that's not hard to, to do. No, so. it's not. Okay, well in that case, let's, let's, let's plant... Well, we could probably do it on this end anyway. Yeah, right here, all we'd have to do is... Yeah. Put well, except then they'd be going... That's going that way, that's going to go... You never know. You never backward. know until you have Oh, no, yeah, the gearbox would be wrong there. Would it? Okay. it? It'd run the short belts backward if the long belt's going in the right direction. Ah. Two gearboxes, then. How's that? All right, and... <laughs> Could work. Box there. Alright, so. These only need to be too short, to be honest. Like, these actually could be one shorter. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Because we're going to be yeah, putting. Yeah, I suppose you're right. Because we're going to be putting the, the outputs directly underneath this. Need uh, another four brats funnels if you got them as well. Uh, I do not. I definitely do not. That, that, is... that should be in the system. Round robin, force round robin. <laughs> Synchronize oh, input. There we go. Yep. Synchronize the input. Yeah, that'll work. And then... Do we have enough outputs ready to go? Uh, we should. Everything's jammed, so there's a full stack in each drawer now. But I mean, uh, buses and buses. Oh, yeah, um... No. I, have, I see no buses, so you're in your inventory. Or we have none ready to go. No, I haven't uh, haven't made any more export buses yet. So we need ten more of these. Eight, nine, ten. Also means we're going to need another color split of cables or another large cable. That, well, yeah, no color split of cables. To... I mean, I wouldn't have to color split ten. these ones. I, I, I do have. Somehow. Yeah, I would I, I, I would have to slow somehow, but yes. Um, what I can do, though, is... All right, I'm going to remove this one. Oh, wrong wrench. I'm going to remove this one temporarily. And run the big cable down here. Two, three... Bring it one more 
so that that goes off by itself. And then I can bring another one over this way. Actually, you know what? How much more of the big cable do I have? Six. If I get the big cable to like right here. Oh, I can't even. Okay. That's right. Big, the little cables though won't even. Uh, or the big cables won't connect to the interface. No, they don't. Okay, so I need at least some kind of color. Or a cable. What is it? The cable mount thing? Yeah, um. The thing that'll like, separate them. Yes, uh, that's a uh, glass, something other. Um. No. A recipe on that? Quartz fiber. That's what I'm looking for. Quartz uh... fiber. Yeah, that'll work. There's there's a couple bits in there. Good. Okay, that's all I really need to separate these. So then I just need to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Stick a quartz fiber on that one, and then I can go. You need the fat cable running down to the just behind the fiber, too. Yes, I know. Uh, to there and there. Ah. I'm short one piece of fat cable and one p and two pieces of regular cable. Uh, cable. Three, four. That'll give me a fat cable. Or there. That's good. And then I heard the the thing kicking kicking in whenever I did that. Um, just two more pieces of this, and that should be it. Nines are there. Oh, of course, nothing's going to happen because nothing's moving, and well, that's fine. Uh, we just need to bring power over to this now. Uh, did we want to try to keep the t do the two different speeds like you were talking about, or just let it run at yeah, whatever speed? Yeah, I think we're I think we're going to need to. Okay, so well, the I don't main know unless belt? will they. I mean, it's just going to wait until it clears. Yeah. Let's see, let's see if Cause I don't think it really has to be two different speeds. I think it'll be fine. It's well, just one's, one, the, one side is going to be waiting. It. I never have figured out how to extend the freaking belts like you've been doing. Uh, you use a belt on the belt. So if you have a mechanical oh, belt, belt, if you have a mechanical belt in your hand and you right click, it'll extend it. Oh, okay. If you have a wrench in your hand, it'll shrink it. If you have a shaft in your hand, it'll add the shaft to the belt at that point. If there's no shaft in it already. All right. Well, we've got everything exported to it. So the belt's here. Really? Oh, I didn't even. Okay. You'd be like that, huh? Yeah, you hit their. You hit their crater. I didn't uh, actually. Oh, well. Matters. Yeah, I might have, but there was a zombie there. And if he wasn't invisible, I might not have hit him. Jerk. Okay, so we're powering it from here, you say? Powering it from here. Yeah, we're good. Okay. We need to power it from somewhere. It doesn't matter which end it's powering from. We just needed them connected at this end. To okay. Get everything flowing in the right direction. Oh, I see. Uh... Just trying to think what the the nicest way to connect these would be. <laughs> yeah. Not really a great. Probably just underneath. Blah! <laughs> That's running backwards. <laughs> 
Hey, uh, I think that's backwards. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. At least the threes and the eights we can put back down in these big drawers. <laughs> oh, I got like a cup four and thirteen sevens left. <laughs> Uh, okay, so that's backward. So let's go with. Oh, dang it. Um, what is it? A uh, gear shift? Or actually, all we really need is another. Uh, another. Your box. No, th th those were fine. Oh, were they? Yeah. We just put another gearbox right at the end of the shaft, feeding into them. Oh, okay. Gotcha. And that makes everything flow the right direction. Yes, it does. That works. Yeah, and it's not... <laughs> yeah, uh, anyway, guys. Um... I want to finish up these. I want to un unlock all these quests before we uh, we head off. And for that, I am actually just waiting on the silicon to catch back up, produce us a few more induction mechanisms that should be going straight down and producing stuff down here. And as soon as we get a bucket's worth, ah, here we go. There we go. Liquefied, unprocessed stuff. Put the bucket back. That will unlock all the rest of these quests. Let me move over here, away from the noisy. Unlock all the rest of these quests. Now we need the threes. Um, we need the pluses, minuses. Oh, we do need a multiplication and division one just f for quest completion purposes. Oh, do we? Yeah, if you want to make one of each of those uh, at least. Okay. Um. And then the eights we've already completed. All right, what's he say? As one of the two available digits, threes can be cast from unprocessed knowledge together with eight operations. Your calculations, you have to create to zero through nine in equal amounts. The casting process can quickly become a bottleneck for most. <laughs> yeah, the casting process can quickly become a bottleneck for most running calculations depending on the number generated here. Make sure things move fluidly. <laughs> fluently, okay, yeah. Um, a second available digit, da da da. From here, plan via which calculations from other digits will be created. We did that. Yep, we've we've got our figure. We've we've got our calculations. Um, we are, like I said, we are only going to use plus and minus for our calculations just to make things easier for ourselves. Uh, but yeah, that's all figured out. Okay. So, back to the book. Back to the book. And then as soon as you get those uh, minus and division, we can unlock that. And then we can do the 1 through 10 contraptions. Yeah, this is all done. And then we need to solve trajectories, which is going to be our... Thank you. Quest complete. Quest complete. Nice. So then we're just waiting on a block of this material to be crafted. That's actually, wow, that's a lot of material it's going to take for that. A lot. We still can't put sevens away. <laughs> yeah, I'm just uh, throwing them into the main system. Yeah. Cool. All the bits that I just had to pull out to, to complete the tasks. Oh, you got them all done? Nice. Check mark. One, check mark. Two, check mark. Four, check mark. Five, check mark. Oop, we don't have a five. Uh, six, check mark. We don't yes. have five. Five or six didn't get counted. Uh, nine is counted. Zero they should counted. have been. I picked them up. I don't know. Oh, uh, maybe, may oh, maybe I didn't because you did it, the order you picked them up in here yeah, because you had the. Well, no, because they're because they're empty drawers. 
wasn't oh. able to actually pick any of them up because they're getting. You clicked it, but you didn't get one. Gotcha. Okay. <laughs> uh, uh, anyway, so that should be five and six. six. And five is the one that everything's waiting on for the entire process here. Yep. So I will grab it out of here when it comes. I would like to get at least a one block of this stuff made before we wrap this episode five. up. Five is done. Okay, for calculations of the guidance computer, we will need a lot of these digits. <laughs> yes. they, they ain't kidding. Uh, before letting I... of each. Oh my gosh. Six. Six. <laughs> 1600? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> I don't think we had 1600 of the things in the barrel up there to start with. Uh, definitely. Well, it's a good thing I've got all the other processes pretty much calibrated because uh, we're going to need to let this run. <laughs> going to need to let it run overnight or something for sure. Uh, but yeah, we did it. We did it. Um, calculations done mostly. Just waiting for this. Yeah, I really want a block of that material. <laughs> We've got a ways to go, I guess. A long way to go to get all that. Maybe we should be using sevens for something else. What's the hold up? Uh, fives? fives are the hold up, actually. Hmm. Fives are the ones that are uh, holding up the actual whole, whole process over there. But it's basically just a matter of getting enough fives to backfill the, the ones and twos back up to, up to full every time it, it loads over there. So, yeah, it's fine. I'm just trying to think of how we can use a seven instead of... I mean, the twos are kind of... Is the twos backed up? No, they're not really backed up. Well, we'd use seven minus six for the ones, but I mean, that'd use less fives and. I mean, we're already, yeah, we, we don't have extra things. sixes though. See, so, yeah, I'm looking at what we have extra. We have extra sevens, yeah. we have extra nines now, and extra twos. Kind of fours? Definitely extra zeros, but those don't do anything for us. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but the sevens and the nines. Maybe we could switch the two so that it's not using five and use nine minus seven for two. Yeah, we could do that. That would free up some fives and then might open up the whole system a little bit. Let me reprogram this real quick. Uh huh. Try to. Okay. Nine minus seven, you said? Yeah, nine minus seven for the twos. And then what is our three is our five a two plus three or is it a is it a minus something? It's a eight minus three. Eight minus three is five. Yeah, no, that's probably the best probably the best way to do All that. Alright, let's let this run for a minute, see what we get now. Yeah, see if that changes our bottleneck at least. Yeah. I would say that definitely is less of a bottleneck now. Yeah. Definitely things are going in faster. Yeah. Actually, they're going actually, in. They look like they're jamming in. They're actually going. The yeah, as I was going to say, they and... actually get to the point where they're jamming. Okay, a but now it's Okay, now I'm waiting on ones. Okay, that's fine. I, I, I don't mind having it wait on something. Well, it's going to have to wait on something. Yeah. I mean, ones are six, or six minus five. Which are sixes or three plus threes. That's a lot of threes we're using up. So having this with a large buffer is not a bad thing at the moment, but it's going to be over time, I think. 
Yeah, that's why I want to get these down to one stack each. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So once those go down below a stack, put the downgrade in them. Yeah. And in, in fact, what I would probably do to just to prevent additional other ones so we can get them all down below a stack is remove their their uh, casting from the table temporarily. Like once we run out of threes oh, anyway. Pretty much just, yeah. Don't even need to remove their casting from the table at the moment because once we get them down to a stack, it'll be... Well, it'll be six stacks in total, honestly, because they've got the the, the hoppers too. B yeah, that's these true. One. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah, that's true. Which is good. It's fine. Yeah, if it keeps up with that, with the casting. Yeah. I just got all the numbers out of the system now too. Well, except for zeros, because well, zeros are special. Yeah, I don't think you're running any zeros to go in there. Like sixes are the way to hold up now. Three, no, four. Four, yeah, four is the hold up. Oh, yeah, sixes and fours are now our bottleneck. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I don't, I don't think, yeah, there'll always be one of them that's the problem. That's, child. And that's fine, honestly. Yeah, yeah. Because it's not much of a bottleneck. I mean, we are still producing. We are up to almost a full bucket of liquefied matrix. So ah, yes, I want to. I want a bucket before we wrap this episode up. I yep. want to. I want to wrap it up on a bucket of liquefied matrix. But you know, this is a lot less space than I expected this whole system to take up. Mm hmm. I expected us to be like all over the place and barely have enough room for the rocket when we're done. Um, but yeah, no, we're gonna have plenty of space. It looks like. Uh, and then of course we got to fill in all of this stuff again with the bricks. Uh, I will leave a hole right here temporarily for us to get down in there and work. Uh, might even do some covers so I can make it look like this goes like right through the uh, through the concrete just to give it that extra uh, and maybe even cover up all these things but I don't know it doesn't look bad no, I do want to go through no, I, uh, I like having access to them right here too I do want to make sure that I go through and uh, like anywhere that I can see dirt through the cracks I hate that yeah but I will go through and fix that when we're not, when I'm not recording. But how close are we now? How close are we now? So close. We're at 800. You say it makes 50 each time? Yeah. Oh, no, not that close. Not that close. Well, that's uh, only four, site, four more full loads to throw, so. Okay. But what are we using fours on? We're using fours on sevens, and that's it. Okay, sevens are almost backed up. We need eight of the computational matrices to fulfill this quest. Oh my god, that's being pulled out. Seven. Sevens only place sevens should be going are over here to twos. Well, it's now that's also making our twos. Yeah, but the twos have been sitting there static. Okay, no, they are. Fours are making it through. Something's making it through. No, nothing's making it through over to here. Or else are fours getting used? Fours aren't getting used anywhere else. Where are they going? Why does it say zero? That's a good question. What I'm trying to figure out. They're going to make sevens. But sevens are backed up. Sevens go to make twos. The two sevens keep disappearing somewhere. 
sevens go to make twos. Twos go to make fours. Fours go to make sevens. Sevens go to make twos. Twos go to fours. Oh god, we made That's a loop. That's what's going on. Yeah, we made a loop. Okay, so if we're gonna have nine minus seven for two, we need to change the four. Let's do one plus three for fours. Oh, except ones are also not not uh, available. How about nine uh, minus five? Nine minus five for two. Yeah, fives are backed up. Yeah, so right are nines. And nines okay, are. So pause everything. <laughs> uh, the thing. Well, hey, at least we figured it out without like letting it run forever. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Before it ran forever, and because isn't that just basic, basically burning up our material? Yeah, pretty much. Was. Was. Okay, seven come out. Why is that a? Yeah, why is that a seven? Because because there was a bit there was a bit of left over before you changed it. Got it. Uh, we got a batch. Okay, got now it's going again. And we're up, we're up eight millibuckets for each again. Okay. Okay, good. This and the smeltery with the way it sits currently has enough for two rounds of digits, two full rounds of digits in there. Two full rounds of digits. Cool. Which it frequently gets to. It looks like. Uh, we need more gravel. Now you got me wondering if we've got any other loops. Like, is the ones being used up for something that's not supposed to? Doesn't look like it. Just eight plus. All right, I think we're okay. Make some more gravel so I can make some Still grouch. waiting on. Fours, but that's because ones. Yeah, I bet that there's a way to like. I'm sure there's a way to like use the most minimal amount of material to get all of your digits, and we're not quite there. So we'll keep fine tuning this over time until we figure out the best way. This isn't terrible right now. It seems to be pretty consistently producing at the moment. So, but like I said, is it the most possible efficient? Possibly not. But we can definitely get there from here. We're close. Yes. We are close. Oh man, I really want to have that thing in my hand when I do my outro. <laughs> Uh, might have to just pause the recording for a minute and let that last hundred millibuckets build up. But yeah, yeah, we'll do that. I'm just gonna sit here, wait for the last hundred millibuckets. We're gonna wrap this up. Uh, next episode, though, let me get away from the machine so we don't have all that noise. Oh, that helped a lot. Did I? It's raining. Great. <laughs> just go, go sleep it off. Just added another three layers to the smeltery as well. Nice. Is that so going to allow? That should be able to hold a third round just in case it ever shoves that many through. Nice. Okay, it's not even nighttime. I can't even sleep the rain away. Urgh. I'm actually kind of surprised I haven't had more the internet being the time of day and the day of the week. But all right, let me go look at this. Still nine hundred. I mean, it is kind of entertaining to just sit here and watch that do math. <laughs> to be, to be honest. <laughs> yeah. 
pause for a moment and change up the nine process as well. What are we doing for nine? You know what we should do is we should be getting... I see why we need the multiplication and division now. For That's for the efficiency. Yeah. So if we had the multiplication and division, we could do three times three for nine. Um, we could also then use the division to... Uh, I don't know if the division... Our right ones and nines are building back up a little bit. Our four is just... Our four is just... Uh... No, fours are going with fives to make... Or nines are going with fives to make four. Am I timing out? Is that what's happening? Because I see nothing moving right now. Possibly, but you are moving around on my screen, so... Do you feel that? Nope. How about yeah, that? no, uh, nope. How about that? Nope. No, I'm <laughs> completely, completely froze up here. Now I've got some. Okay, no, no, I just nothing's happening on my screen. Hmm. Dang it! Well, in that case, as much as I really wanted to have that in my hand, uh, before this does me the timeout oh, message. Oh, dang it! Dang it! <laughs> yeah, I just realized I created another loop by doing that. Yeah, oops. Yeah, don't do that. Um, all right, folks. Uh, we're gonna keep we're gonna keep calibrating this until we get it uh, as best as we can with what we got. Uh, we'll just you'll just have to see that at the beginning of the next episode because my internet is starting to fail and I am gonna get a timeout any second now because you can see there's nothing happening on my screen. <laughs> But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to help out the channel. And ring that bell like your village was under attack. But till then, guys, till next time, I will catch you later. Bye-bye. Hey, you're moving again. Hey, I see things moving again. Ah. Well, anyway, guys, till next time. Oh, all the noises catching up with.